I can see you it, can yeah. You can move your hand slowly, yeah, yeah, left yeah, and right, yeah, yeah. and then choose it. So, uh, right now it's connected. We're here at the TCL, and hi, so who are you? I'm uh, David Derrida, Head of Product for Europe. And uh, what is he wearing there? So, he's wearing a concept, uh, ethical project partnery. And the, the idea here is uh, to show some true display innovation. So, you so imagine uh, yeah. you want to experience a very, uh, an extra large display watching uh, video, watching Netflix. So uh, I can see the two micro displays that are, that are in there, right? You have two, you can see on both eyes. What yes. do you see? I see like three, I mean a, a big screen, like you have the impression you have like an immersive experience. Yeah. It's like a it's one inch. Is yeah. it augmented something? No, it's not, not really augmented for now, but I guess, you know, we will be working to make is the that camera AR as well. No, so for now the use case is to watch a movie, yeah. uh, and basically yeah. you have just in front of you the impression that's truly immersive, like a, a 100 inch display. And this is connected over Type-C to your new phone? To the TCL Plex that we are announcing today. It's let's working. Show, let's show the phone. So you launched this phone today, uh, TCL Plex. TCL Plex, uh, our first uh, smartphone uh, TCL branded, available in black and white. So that's what we are announcing today. What's really cool about the TCL Plex is that uh, TCL is, is famous about displays. So. So and it's a very nice display. Uh, yeah, exactly. Yes, so it's very nice display. What's the size? So it's a 6.53 uh, I mean, inch display yeah, I mean, uh, with a dodge. Uh, so the 24 uh, megapixel yeah, selfie yeah, yeah. camera is here in the hall. We call it a dodge. We call it a dodge. So it's a dot notch. We registered this uh, trademark. So it's not a notch, but it's a dodge. Yes. Yeah. Uh, not, not, what do you call it? Dutch? Yeah, Dutch. Dutch. So what's really unique about this phone is the what we call the next vision. And the next vision is uh, basically coming from our expertise on, di on displays, on TV, on large displays. And we'll provide some enhancements on the fly, converting SDR to HDR, for example, on the fly. So you are uh, doing some AI kind of stuff to the video content or something? So we've got a dedicated chipset that we call Next Vision that will optimize the pictures, the video, gaming experience on the fly. And here I would just... Does it optimize all the UI also and everything or...? The UI is not going to be super visible. media content, right? But media content, I will just show you example here. This is uh, the, with the same brightness, you have the same picture here without next vision so that's what you would experience on the a normal phone today and this is with next vision activated so you can experience really the improvement of the pictures the videos on the fly so it's doing an ai analysis of the image and it's adding kind of brightness and it or adjusting something. the colors the brightness the contrast on the fly uh, so it's a, a machine learning part of the soc or something like that right yeah kind of it yeah What's the chipset you're using? So uh, we call it Next Vision. Uh, it's a chipset uh, which is uh, optimized only for uh, pictures and multimedia optimizations. But uh, what's the CPU on, uh, on your phone? So on the phone, the CPU is a Snapdragon 675. So it's a Qualcomm CPU. And in addition to this Qualcomm CPU, we have a dedicated display engine that we call Next Vision. And uh, it looks really nice. Um, what's going on here? So uh, here you've got triple camera on the back. Uh, you've got a 48 megapixel camera, which is uh, a sensor from Sony, very high quality. Uh, the sensor in the middle is 2.9 micrometer low light, so our objective is to have uh, extremely good video in low light environment. Uh, and the one on the left is the wide angle up to 123 degrees. Um, so that's the three cameras on the back. If you go on the, uh, the camera application here. Can you take a low light picture right now? So oh, here you get, we have a, a, a demo if you want to record the, the, or compare with your current phone. If I select here, I can experience the three sensors on the fly. So you can see the main sensor here, the wide angle, and here the low light will not show you um, the major difference, but you have a demo of low light. Does there. it take it automatically, the low light, or you have to select it? No, so you, by default, it's set to automatic. It's a smart system, it just yes. goes automatically. By default, it's set to automatic, but uh, if you want to go manual uh, to have uh, all the pictures, photo optimization, you can also do it manual.
can you do a lot of bokeh? Yes. Uh, you've got portrait mode. You take one with me? Sure. Okay. So then uh, around it creates a bokeh, but it's uh, is a optical bokeh or is it a AI kind of bokeh? It's, uh, it blurs the background a little bit? Yes. Like by artificial intelligence? Uh, yeah, absolutely. And uh, running Android latest? Running uh, latest Android will be upgraded to Android 10 very quickly. And the price is going to be good? So we are announcing today at 329 euros. Uh, we are going to launch next month in uh, several European countries. And you can start uh, pre-orders on uh, Amazon uh, in Germany, for example, today. Uh, the smart glass system, is there any price for this? Or no, it's too early, so we're just showing concept today. Yeah, say yeah. 4 .99, No, 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 not today. Okay, cool. All right, so uh, this is the TCL smartphone for the first time in Europe, no? First time we ever launched a smartphone under the TCL brand, coming together with all the great display stories we announced today. USA? Or just talking about Europe only? The October will be uh, Europe uh, in some countries, but progressively we will deploy to other countries. The objective will be uh, USA next year. Okay.